We're trying to make a hundred year old house a passive house. So when we were planning this project, one of the questions that came up from pretty much every builder that we talked to was why not just bulldoze the thing and start over? One of the things we really like is the neighborhood. Um, we've been here a while now. The city has gone to great effort to build a park across the street. And then the neighborhood has character. The, the streets are curved, the houses are old, the trees are mature. We know our neighbors. They're also some of the characters. needed a little bit more space. So we're starting in on a project. And in the course of doing that, we're like, what do we do with the existing house? What level of energy efficiency do we target? And how do we get there? What's even possible? And so what we're looking at is how do we increase the insulating value of this? How do we seal it up so that it's airtight and make our house a lot more comfortable? So when we moved in, the house had stucco on the walls all the way around. So we took that stucco off to give us a nice flat plane to work with. And then we had those planks there. You can see some of them here still. And the planks had lots of gaps in them. They let tons of air through. So we put this membrane on here, which is our air and vapor barrier. And that keeps the air in the house. It manages moisture um, in the walls and gives us another flat plane. Then outside of that, we've got these trusses coming out and that's to give us depth for insulation. We're gonna blow cellulose in here that'll be 10 inches deep and that'll keep us warm in our walls. So after we got the walls taken care of, we've now got the foundation here. Here you can see the original foundation is this gray and outboard of that, we've got eight inches of foam. This is the part you can see above grade, but it goes all the way down uh, eight feet to the footing. Yeah, so now we're at the point where we have to finish putting on all these trusses. Once we get those on, we've got another membrane that goes on the outside of the trusses to hold in the insulation, and then we're going to blow some insulation in. And we're looking forward to that around here because it's going to actually allow us to warm the house up a bit more. Because you're still living in here full time. We, we are still living here full time.